Louis has a decent sized family, four grandparents, two parents, two aunts, two uncles, two cousins, a sister, and of course herself. Today, I'll talk about the history of Louis's family. Before we start, please subscribe as it'll help me out a ton. Thanks. We'll be starting on Bandit's side of the family, with Nana and Bob Healer. I already made a video talking about all the grandparents, so I won't go too in depth in this video, but if you wish to see the history of the grandparents, check out this video linked in the description. Their age is unknown, and it's unknown when they met, but it's known that they were together before the year 1980, as shown in Fairy Tale. If we fast forward to the present though, it's known Nana is still living well on the Gold Coast, but Bob's whereabouts are unknown, as he has been missing since the episode Grannies. But going back in the past, they gave birth to their first child named Radley Healer, presumably sometime in the 1970s, but possibly in the very late 1960s as well. Rad is the oldest child of Nana and Bob. In fairy tale, he's portrayed as the more mature sibling out of Bandit and Stripe. Made you lucky, Daddy Chuck. And nicer as well. Bandit, stop teasing Stripe. In the present, he's shown to be muscly and have really nice hair. And he was a bit too muscly. You know what I mean, kids? Compared to his brothers, he's the only one that hasn't been married yet. Why don't you have a wife? Well, well how do you know I don't? Do you have a wife? Well, no. Despite being the oldest, he doesn't know why he doesn't have a wife, but he knows it might be because he works at an oil rig, which is also why he never visits Bluey or Bingo on Christmas. Why do we only see you at Christmas? Because I work on an oil rig. Is that why you don't have a wife? Oh, maybe. However, he may get married soon, as in the episode Double Babysitter, he meets the character Frisky, who is Bluey's godmother. Hi. And towards the end of Double Babysitter, they're shown bonding on the porch. It's known that Frisky was previously in a relationship with a person named Bosco. Will Bosco be the daddy? Um, no. Bosco and I aren't friends anymore. Who's Bosco? No one. In Christmas Swim, it's shown that they're spending Christmas with each other, and not with the family. This proves that they may now be in some sort of relationship together, and while they're not confirmed married, they might be soon. But let's go to his other brother, Bandit. Bandit is the middle child, and it's known he was 10 years old at some point in the 1980s, meaning he was born sometime in, during the 1970s. As shown in Fairy Tale, he was the mean brother who always picked on Stripe. You can't tic tac Stripe. It's my turn now. Now it isn't. Even nowadays, he still teases Stripe a little bit, but he also likes to bond with his brother. In Squash, Bandit plays Squash with Stripe. Bandit is very obviously better than Stripe at Squash. <laughs> Why do you keep losing? Because big brothers always beat little brothers. He also likes to play rugby, as shown in Fruit Bat, and he likes to play cricket, as shown in Cricket. He's known to be an archaeologist, and sometimes he has to fly for his job, as shown in Curry Quest. He's presumably the first of his brothers to get married, as he married Chili. Chili first met Bandit in the 1980s during the episode Fairy Tale. Chili claims she never remembers that happening, but Bandit does, and claims it was her. Don't listen to him, it wasn't me. Don't listen to her, it was. They both really met for the first time at a party in London. Um, why did you meet Dad? Well, there's some dispute, but let's just say at a party in London. From which they ended up going on a vacation to Europe. They both have children, but Chili's family has had a lot of issues with having children. Chili was born to her dad, Mort, and her mom, whose name is unknown. Her mother died at some point before giving birth to her first child, Bluey. She also has a sister named Brandy. Brandy cannot have any children, as it's revealed in the episode onesies that she's infertile and incapable of having any children. Why can't she just have the thing she wants? Because it's not meant to be. Chili had issues with pregnancy as well, as it's implied in both the show and Sleepy Time that she had a miscarriage before she had Bluey. So then they... She also doubted her motherhood often in the episode Baby Race. When she met Bandit, she ended up marrying him and having children, and the first child she had was Bluey. Bluey is obviously the main character of the show, so there isn't much to talk about her since her entire life is shown in front of us. She was born to Bandit and Chili, and despite what others say, she is a girl. I'm a girl! When she was first shown in the show, she was 6 years old, and this is confirmed in the episodes such as Yoga Ball and Chess. I'm 6! Are you still 6? Wow. However, in Past the Parcel, she aged up to be 7 years old, along with just about all the other characters. Her favorite animal was previously a zebra, which then changed to a fruit bat, which then changed again to a cheetah. I used to be, but I changed to cheetahs. She is also a yellow bow in martial arts, as shown in Bin Night, and it's also shown that she could play the recorder in the same episode. 
She is shown in every single episode in the show, except for Turtle Boy and Slide. She also has a little sister named Bingo. Bingo was born about two years after Bluey. She was four years old in the beginning of the show, but she turned five in the episode Handstand, which shows her birthday. She is very active at her age since she takes both ballet, uh, something about ballet class. gymnastics, uh, that takes me to gymnastics, and mini hockey. I have to take Bingo to mini hockey. Despite Chili giving birth to her, she also looks very similar to Chili's sister, Brandy. Who do I look like? You look just like... You. She also has a whole episode dedicated to herself, the episode titled Bingo. But let's backtrack to Bandit's little brother, Stripe. Stripe is the youngest sibling and was born presumably in the 1970s, though it's very possible he was born in the early 1980s. As shown in Fairy Tale, he was constantly picked on by Bandit. You can't skid, Stripe! He also likes to play rugby and cricket, just like Bandit, and is shown to play squash with Bandit. Stripe was presumably the second of his brothers to get married, as he married Trixie, and his children are younger than Bluey and Bingo. It's unknown when Trixie met Stripe, and not much is known about Trixie other than that she plays hockey with Chili, Aunt Trix and I are off to play hockey, and tries to eat healthy. Nah, I'm off the chips, I'm trying to eat healthy. Good on you. Both him and Trixie have children named Muffin and Socks. Muffin is the oldest and is Bluey and Bingo's cousin. She was three years old in the beginning of the show, but she turned four around the episode past the parcel. She also cannot pronounce her R's. It was a in many episodes, she's known to be a hi hyperactive three-year-old, sometimes a bit mean and spoiled as well. She also throws a lot of tantrums as portrayed in The Quiet Game. In charades, she complained the entire episode. I don't In a library, she was mean to both Bluey and Bingo because she could do whatever she want because she is special. I can play however I want. Her sister Socks, on the other hand, is a lot nicer. Socks is one year old, but it's assumed she's two after she learned how to speak and walk on two legs. In season one, she was shown to walk on all fours and act like a dog, notably in Bumpy and the Wise Hold Wolf Town. Bumpy went everywhere together. I'll have some carrots, please, shopkeeper. Bumpy loves. And Veranda Santa. There's been many theories as to why she walks like a dog, since none of the other characters do that, and the most popular theory is that she has autism. Unlike her sister, though, she is a lot more well behaved. <laughs> and she also does not struggle to pronounce her R's, despite being younger. She is also one of the youngest characters in the show and the youngest character in the Healer family. Thanks for watching, please like and subscribe, and I'll see you all later.